Say Something by Peggy Moss, illustrated by Leah Lyon. There's a kid in my school who gets picked on all the time. I think he's sad. I think he's sad because he keeps his head down when he walks down the hall. And he hardly ever says hello. I don't pick on him. I feel sorry for him. There's another kid in my school who gets teased. He gets called names. When he's moving through the halls, kids push him and tell him he's slow. I walk on the other side of the hall. I don't say those things. A girl who rides on my bus always sits alone. Sometimes kids throw things at her and call her names. The girls who sit behind her laugh. I don't laugh. I don't say anything. One day, my friends were out and I had to sit alone in the cafeteria. Some kids came over to me and they started telling jokes. I laughed until the jokes started to be about me. My face burned. I looked down at the table. I sat on my hands to keep them from moving so much. I tried not to cry, but it was hard not to cry. And when they saw my face getting wet, the kids started laughing. I wished I could stop crying. I wished I could disappear. When the kids left, I looked around the cafeteria. I was surprised to see that the cafeteria was full of students. There were even kids I knew sitting at the table right next to mine. They were looking at me. I could tell they felt sorry for me. When I went home, I told my big brother I was mad at the kids at the table next to mine. He shrugged and said, why? They didn't do anything. Right, I said. On the bus the next day, I sat next to the girl who always sits alone. She's really funny. Why do you think the book is called Say Something? Why do you think nobody says anything?